I have to leave this island at 6 a.m. I need the ferry here to take me to Naxos. And then Naxos, I have to jump on a plane that cannot be delayed. <laughs> and that plane has to get me to Athens. I'm gonna let the sun shine in the day. Actually, the ferry's pulling up right now. I'm trying to make this darkness go away. Check. One goal was I had to get off of the island of Amorgos. Okay, now I'm on. <laughs> now I have to get off, off the island of Naxos. Hey, thanks for the ride. Listen, we're right here for two hours. Welcome, welcome to, welcome to Naxos. This is an airport island, and it's going to allow me to get to Athens. Yes, yes, thank you. So far the plan is working. with plenty of time to spare it, but this was the only flight out, so there wasn't any wiggle room for lateness. The lounges are on the other side. I couldn't get there, so in the middle of a very busy bathroom, I just got dressed. One of the sweetest things about first class and business is the sooner you get on board, there's a lot that happens, a lot. Do you want some coffee? Do you want this? Do you want this? Do you want... There's a lot of do you want this, yes. And I'm not excited. This is the icing on what has been a very delicious Greek cake. Right? Listen, <laughs> cheers to everybody who came along on my vacation. <laughs> Clink! Oh. All right, excellent, thank you. Is everything I need for my trip. So let's see. Oh, I get my own bottle of cologne this time. Oh, this is every little bit of grooming, cleaning, brushing, and combing for my trip. Thank you, Emirates. The distinct difference between the classes, except for the obvious, is up here, it's everything on demand. But more importantly, privacy. You will get you will get a better vlog because of this space. Anyway, I went home and did this last time. I was like, I didn't know dates and coffee were so good. It was an orange peel. Divine. You know what's so extra nice about this? It's because I've had I've had three weeks of acting like a goat, <laughs> crawling on rocks and covered in sea salt, and I'm ending it with luxury. Passengers, loosen your seatbelt and make sure your appetite is in the upright position because the Emirates first class menu is a culinary adventure. Emirates signature caviar, sea bream fish filled with pine nuts and leek, Greek style green beans, Greek poke bowl, a marinated octopus salad with sweet melon, onion, and feta cheese.
said in another video, I'm not an adventurous eater, but... This was an unbelievable combination of what seemed like pineapple, red onion, and feta cheese. Cheers. luxury. Meatball's Puppy Center? That I couldn't, I couldn't do any of this without Meatball's Puppy Center. She's getting everything, everything. Everything. That screwdriver, I'd give her the lights. 
The attendants here are lovely. I, we're having conversations about where have I been and how long I've been gone and how badly I miss my dog. She's like, oh, you have a cute, oh, cute dog. So she comes back. Meatball has an Emirates Airlines squeaky toy. of luxury, right? I'm, I'm thankfully impressed by the kindness. Anyway, thank you, thank you, thank you Emirates, thank you Emirates. Is it a trip if we don't visit the end? Listen, this is the Emirates first class bathroom. Do you know how words matter? Because this flight's coming to an end. This vacation's coming to an end, the eating's coming to an end, the spending's coming to an end, the role of ladies, it's all coming, no it's not, it's coming to a pause. Yeah, you have to be careful. Careful with the words. So sure, I might be getting off of the flight, I might have, I might be leaving these islands, I might have put those rollerblades away, but it's just a pause. It's not an end. This flight, lands in an hour, an hour and a half, so say your goodbye to the Emirates first class bathroom.